starting the bulletin with the latest in Myanmar. Myanmar's deposed leader Aung San Suu Kyi has appeared in person at a court hearing for the first time since her government was overthrown by the military in a February 1 coup. She also affirmed that her party National League for Democracy will exist as long as people exist in an attempt to boost the morale of people who have been fighting for the restoration of democracy. Her lawyer, Thai Mong Mong, said that Suki looked in good health and held a face-to-face -face meeting with her legal team for about 30 minutes before the hearing. Earlier, the military junta chief has also confirmed the same about Suki. Min Ong Hilang has justified his power grab by citing alleged electoral fraud in the November poll, which was won by the NLD in a landslide. The junta has threatened to dissolve Suu Kyi's National League for Democracy party over alleged voter fraud in the 2020 election. Suu Kyi has not been seen in public since the February 1 coup. So far, she has appeared only by video link and the junta had cited security reasons for not allowing her to speak to her lawyers in private. Suu Kyi, along with 4,000 others, have been detained since the coup. Remember, last time Suki appeared by a video link before a judge in the capital city of Naipitao. She was accused of another fresh criminal charge. The additional charge is of breaching a law intended to control the spread of the coronavirus. The second such charge against her un under the same law. She's already facing charges of illegally importing walkie-talkies, unlicensed use of them, inciting public unrest and breaking the Official Secrets Act. The junta has also accused Aung San Suu Kyi of corruption and presented on state television what it said was evidence that she took bribes.